Hello family, this is the next video that I have for you. And these are the items that I am going to be working on using as far as skincare and makeup for 2013 from January to April of 2013. Some of these you've seen before, um, for example, my NYX Cinnamon Blush. I'm working on using this up and I have four months to finish it. So it should be done by then because I'll be wearing it every day when I go to work. Not when I'm off, but when I'm at work, I will be wearing that particular blush. My foundation from Sudevit in Kimberly Plateau. I'm really working to finish this foundation up because I love it and I don't want it to go bad. I'm like... You can't really see it, but I'm like halfway, let me see, I'm halfway through the bottle, so I'm going to continue working on that. I'm going to continue working on using the present. I like it because it does smooth your face and your skin, and it is oil-free. I just want to finish using it up. You do need to let this set on your face for two minutes, and I may just do a separate video for this particular product on its own, but I do love it a lot. Okay. Um... I am, of course, trying to finish up this Pop Pin Up palette. And the only color that I'm working on now is this gold color right here, which I have on as a highlight. I mean, yeah, as on my brow bone today. I want to finish it up. It's, it's going to take some time. It took me forever to use up the other ones. But I want to continue working on it. I am going to continue to work on this bronze. I have a backup, of course. I'm going to continue working on this CoverGirl Queen Collection bronzer. It is my favorite bronzer. I have it on right now. It, it just looks lovely. It warms my face up. It gives my face dimension. It's awesome. I love it. I have the NYX blush on top of it to give me like a glowy effect. But I think I look great. You know? Um, What else? I am finishing up this... L'Oreal Voluminous Carbon Black Mascara and also this Maybelline The Foxy Volume Express Mascara. I, if you can look at my lashes, I am really loving it. I'm loving both of these. Um, I like this one more than this one, but I have this one on today. The drier this one is becoming, the more I like it. Um, this one is just drying out, so I'm just waiting to finish it up. Okay? And then, of course, I'm going to be, when I do my videos, I will be wearing the Iman Stick Foundation unless I'm doing a review on a foundation. Now, I've already told you in a previous video that I'll be using the Fashion Fair Foundation essentially every day for a few months just to give you an idea of what I feel about it. So I'll use that and then I'll continue working on finishing up my um, Sue Devitt Foundation. Okay? So as far as, oh, and I'm also going to be using my press, my press powder and earth medium from Iman. Um, I haven't really worn it all. I'll be wearing it, wearing it, I'll be wearing it to work too. So I'm just going to be floating some things, but this is something that I do want to finish in 2013. So, and I have one in dark too. I don't know how I'm going to utilize that one, but I have it. So I just want to use it. I'm still continue using my Tea Tree Therapeutic Toner from, I think it's Boots or something. Yeah, Booth. It's a Booth product. So I'm going to continue using that. I'm going to continue working on my Peter Thomas Roth Laser Free Resurfacer Serum. I love this stuff. I just haven't been using it the way I should. I am going to continue. I haven't done it in like months, but I'm going to use my Azuvian's peels. I think I have maybe three or four left. I'm going to use these up. I am going to continue using my Declatone from Hydroxytone because I do enjoy it. I am going to continue using my... Yeah, I just wanted to make sure. I'm going to continue using my Azuvian's multi-day, multi-protective day fluid with SPF 15. I'm going to continue working on this. I'm going to continue using my Too Faced Shadow Insurance, Shadow Insurance Primer. This is the primer that I've been using, people, and it's been lasting forever. Like, I use it every time I wear eyeshadow. It just doesn't die. So I'm going to continue working on the little guy because I figure why open up the big ones when you have all these little ones 
Well, I think I have this one and one more just hanging around. And they do a pretty good job. And I'm satisfied. So I don't have any problems. So I'll continue working on this. And then... I'm also going to throw in this Smashbox Photo Finish More Than Primer Dark Spot Correcting. I'm going to continue put this back into my rotation because I really haven't tried been working on my skincare the way that I should. So I want to get back in the habit of taking care of myself. And then, of course, I have samples of different things that I want to try. And I have products that I haven't opened before. And I'll introduce you to some of those items as I continue on. So we shall see. I may start doing like um, a pill a week and a facial once a week or something just to like up up my usage of my products, you know. And hopefully that'll up up that'll up my the way my skin looks and feels. Cause my skin when I use this one, especially my my skin feels really great. So I'll talk more about this one later. So um, that skincare and makeup. That I'm going to be dil diligently working on. Now as far as hair care y'all. Uh, yeah. So I'm just going to work on that as I go through. I kind of like opening stuff and trying it. But since some of my stuff is all natural. I can't really be doing that. So I need to work on using certain items completely up now. So that's what I'm going to focus on do doing. Some of them have a short shelf life. And I want to make sure that, they, that I use up these products before the shelf life is over with. Yeah. That's where I am right now. So once again, this is True Sugar coming at you with my Use It Up, Use It Up products from January of 2013 to April of 2013, and I'll give you an update, of, uh, do an update video once I get closer to that, and that'll probably be more of an empties video once I get closer to that point in time. Um, if you have any questions or concerns, you can hit me up on the YT, and you can message me. And if you would like the content of the videos that you see, please um, subscribe. Thank you and have a great day.